What's up guys, Aaron Productions here and today I'm going to be doing a demonstration of Priority Audio uh, Fire Alarm System or basically off a fire alarm system. So basically how this works, I'll explain it before I show it, is here you have your regular amplifier that's going to play music through your speakers which then goes into this dual relay here um, then finally goes to the speaker but the reason that I have the relay here is so that voice evacuation messages can be introduced when the fire alarm uh, panel activates. So, um, this kind of looks a little bit confusing to most people, I'm sure. So, I drew it on this whiteboard. Make sure that the speakers that you have are rated for 70 or 100 volts. This one's 70 volts. So, I have red and black for the positive and negative. The reason we need a dual relay instead of a single relay is because we cannot have the negative spliced together because there are two different amplifiers. So, first of all, we'll take our negative, which I'm going to put the negatives on this side. Oh, I can't even draw with this now. Okay, so here's the amplifier music. It goes right into, oops, sorry. Apologize. It goes into the normally closed terminal. If I could draw it into there. Normally closed means that um, when there's no power applied to the relay, that side will always be making contact. Then we take our voice evac negative and bring it to the normally open because we want it to not be playing um, music or voice evac sounds when the panel isn't activated or when there's no power to the relay now the reason I didn't put it to the common is because the common is basically um, goes to both the terminals so we need it to be switching between the two sources so the common will be going to the speaker because that's the central point so if there's amp music coming in or even if there is and the thing is overridden goes in the normally closed goes through the normally closed to the speaker and then when the voice vac comes on, it cuts off that and then moves it to the normally open terminal. Uh, so then it'll play through the speaker, the voice vac, and this will be cut off. So then we're going to do the same thing with our positives. Take our voice and put it onto the normally open. Take our amp, put it onto the normally closed, and take the common and put it onto the speaker. Now what we need to do is hook it up to our alarm panel which will be a notification appliance circuit or some sort of control module. <clears throat> and we'll go down here to the negative. <clears throat> so down here, you can take a closer look at that. But down here, so this is my input for power and this is my input for audio from the EVAC panel. <clears throat> This wouldn't be speaker, I mean, this wouldn't be FPL, but this is my input for the regular speaker. And then on the back of the speaker, we have our negative and our positive. Now, as you can see here, it's not coming up well, but there's settings for 70 volts and 100 volts since this is a commercial speaker. You can't use a uh, regular speaker on here. It would probably blow up or something. I don't know. So our audio input, like I said, from the voice back panel goes into the normally open because we don't want it to be making contact when there's no um, voice evac going to be playing. <clears throat> and then our audio that's for regular music comes into the normally closed. So that just goes up there. I'll do a quick showing of how a relay works. Okay, so this is how a relay works. So right now we do not have the relay energized that's why it's going to the normally closed terminal but if we energize the relay this becomes opened and the normally open becomes closed now see how this central terminal always has the um, power going to it no matter which way it is because I apologize my video cut off there um, but we're finally going to get to the demonstration so I put the relay up so you could see it, and now I'm going to play some non-copyright sounds, or no copyright, 
and then we'll override it with a voice evac message or tone in message now um, mine isn't the professional voice evac system like a regular one it is playing a, a music through a different amplifier or not music I apologize a voice evac message that I had so let's play some regular music <laughs> Now I'll turn the uh, relay off and then we'll play the music Please again. So that's basically how priority audio works. It overrides the other audio um, with the relay. You can use a music relay. I believe they sell those, but this was just easier to do. Probably sounds better. But that's going to be it for this video, guys. Thanks for watching. Peace out.